Oh, there's a mountain view out there, you can see. The mountains had always been home for Ruth Reeser and her husband, Warner. For most of their 67 years together, they lived in Estes Park, Colorado. Growing older made it difficult to care for their mountain home, so they moved down the canyon to Good Samaritan Society Loveland Village in Loveland, Colorado. But four years ago, things started to change when Ruth's husband, Warner, fell and broke his arm. As Warner's health continued to decline, Ruth became a full-time caregiver. By the time he passed away two years ago, Ruth's own well-being had deteriorated enough that she struggled to move independently and needed a walker. In a letter she wrote telling her story, Ruth describes being 85 years old and wanting a change. After he passed away, I had to reinvent myself, become somebody else. At first, I thought about playing bingo, but thought, well, no, that's not right for me. So forward and back, come on, forward and back. Oh, right and back. What was right for Ruth was a complete transformation. For starters, she joined wellness manager Jeff Feiner's floor exercise class. We see this in a good portion of the people that have been, like Ruth's story, uh, caretakers, right? We would see her approaching the building. She lives, obviously, in a twin home and there would be a gasp, sort of a collective gasp from the senior living team as she attempted to get up on the sidewalk. Ruth says she had to start all over, but as the weeks passed, something incredible started to happen. What Ruth did that was exceptional, that made the whole thing exceptional, atypical, if you will, is that her repetition was intense. I mean, she started entering classes, and she stayed, and she didn't miss a beat. I used to wake up dread, dread going, but push myself, but I don't have to push myself anymore. It's, it's easier now. <laughs> this is where we defy the odds. Ruth has advanced so much that she's now able to do what is impossible for most her age, get on the floor and continue her workout. I mean, you'll see these folks, they'll have no trouble at all. They'll be up and down. And, and then all their hard work pays off. And you'll see just how easy it is now for these folks to get up. Ruth is able to pull herself to her feet with ease. For Jeff, watching this little miracle happen is why he's here. You know, you have this deficit, right? And you, you know, and you take it, you know, with the right tools to the, as far as you can. In class, you saw her go from this to go, oh, I know how to, I know what to do about this. After 45 minutes, you'd think she'd be exhausted. Body tap, whole body tap, starting from the But shoulder. after a short break, it's time for Ruth's Tai Chi class. The other side. Ruth uses Tai Chi to help improve her balance and movement. She moves in this class in a completely different way than she did two years ago when we first started working together. She does it with an almost dance-like grace. That translates into being able just to navigate the world better. Doesn't this sound like the king writing a letter? Fitness classes aren't the only thing that have made Ruth stronger. She's at Bible study every Wednesday and attends church here on Sundays. She says Loveland Village's long list of weekly activities is why she has been able to reshape her life. When Ruth finishes her activities for the day, she can step confidently back out into her world. A cold, snowy Colorado day, and she navigates it with strength and a renewed sense of well-being, thankful for her surroundings. I'm more mentally active, more physically active, more spiritually active in every way. It's really, it really changed my life. So.